Hi, it's Carlos Gutierrez. Welcome here from Coldwell Banker International Previews right here in beautiful San Diego. Now today I've got a really great topic we're going to talk on is what offers the best offer to take when you get a multiple counter offer situation and especially like a market we're dealing with right now. Hi, it's Carlos Gutierrez and welcome to my one minute real estate update. Today we're going to talk about a hot market that we're dealing with right now here in San Diego in a lot of parts of the country. We're dealing with low inventory, we're dealing with the lowest interest rates still in the history of the world, and we're dealing with a lot of buyers coming out now in the spring and in the summertime. It's a great time to take advantage of the market, especially with those low prices, considering the low interest rates out there, and it's really a seller's market right now. Buyers are getting in because they see the value in those interest rates. So my topic today is, as a seller, which offer is the best one to take? For instance, I just had one, multiple counter offers, and the client had an offer that was more money. However, he wanted to decide to take the one with less money, just a little bit. However, it was $10,000. The thing was, though, it was his terms. It was a shorter contingency time period from 10 days or 21 days, that's almost two weeks, and then another month almost in regards to the closing date. So you'd rather have a little less money but make sure it's gonna close in a shorter amount of time. So really the question is, is your agent gonna do that job for you? They're gonna ask the questions up front and make sure they're on your side to get you the best possible buyer to close escrow on your home. If you have any questions regarding anything real estate related, give me a call. It's Carlos Gutierrez here, Coldwell Banker International, 858-864-8741. And thank you for your time and we'll see you at our next video update.